the 12 days of Christmas cookies and wait till you see Stam Sutter again. We're sharing some of our favorite cookies, bringing our favorite chefs and bakers with a holiday spin on them. Take it away, Sam. All right, so George, it's not just about the sweater, although, come on. Carla, wait a minute, can I, can I just show Carla's boots before we even get to cookies? Because this is America. This is how Carla Hall is in the kitchen, and that to me is everything. But this is a true <laughs> classic. I think I had to show them. I mean, come on, right? This is a true classic oatmeal cookie. Ah, uh, it's got. If there's anything new or different about it, it's the white chocolate and a little bit of cranberry. Yes. Now you are going to catch Carla, by the way, a uh, host of Food Network's Holiday Baking Championships. So good morning, and good thank morning. you for all of that because I loved it. I mean, the higher the cookie, the closer to the universe. <laughs> let's do it. All right, so let's do it. So first of all, I am creaming my butter and all my white sugar and my brown sugar. Got it. But when you see. When you see on a recipe room temperature butter, a lot of times people's butter, it's it's too soft. So you want to make sure your butter holds its shape. So I can bend, I can actually bend this butter and it holds its shape. So don't microwave it to liquid and then do it. I know, look at no. the face, but 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 let me tell no. you, when someone like me here is soft in the butter, that's the easy way to do it. Correct. So don't just let that. it sit out. Let it sit out. All right, so while I'm doing this, I want you to mix all of the dry ingredients into the flour. We have baking soda, so we have cinnamon, we have nutmeg, we have baking powder, and some uh, Do you really salt. trust me with this? I do, it, because it's already measured. Because you measured it out. All right, no. Right. So you're doing Perfect. that. All right. I am adding my eggs to this one at a time right. and also you don't want to over mix your butter you don't want to it's not a cake you want to keep the structure of your butter and your mix and that makes the difference in how a cookie is dense yes is because that? well that also makes a difference when it spreads if you uh, over with your butter uh. yes you know, uh, all those cookie exchanges that are going on out there, y'all, come on. Well, Carla's got a lot to talk about with cookies. because This goes into all of it? Uh, no, we got to put okay. the flour in here. So we're going to go into the because flour. Because you're a cookie, like, really a cookie connoisseur. connoisseur. Right. That's yeah. the word I would get. <laughs> Matt, Jinx, you owe me a Coke. Um, that, that's the word I was going to go with. You care about this. I care about cookies. I love cookies. I had a cookie business. And I really love about textures. I love tiny cookies, yeah. you know. So I put the flour in there. And then the other thing. So we're putting oatmeal in here. We mm -hmm. have cranberries. We have white chocolate. But you can mix these. So I'm and for the oats, not quick oats, whole oats. Whole oats. Yes, this makes a difference. In Another the thing I do cookie. wrong. All right, whole oats. All right. Uh, that goes in. All right, and then instead of white chocolate, you can do dark chocolate. You're gonna put this in here. Now I kind of like this because this is a little different. I like the flavor of it because we ate them during the break. We did. So cranberries, uh -huh. but you can mix this up. It's okay. You can do apricots. You can do milk chocolate, dark chocolate. And all let right? this thing go. I mean, I'm worried about an appliance working like this okay, all we'll the time. Is that all right? Yeah. Turn How do off. I? Where's the button for okay. this? Right, right there. All right. Pull it toward you. Pull, pull it toward me. Okay. Yeah. Don't push it forward, or the whole thing goes flying out. And Robin, <laughs> I can't be. Responsible for that. All right. right. So the other thing is, you can make this dough ahead. You can freeze it up to three months. I have it in this bag. So when you're freezing in this bag, you can just stack the bags in. That makes your holiday so easy because when people are coming over, it's like bam, bam, bam. Exactly. And then we bam, bammed our wrist right here. So we're gonna cut this like this, just like this, because we cut the dough and we just take this and put it on the sheet pan. So I don't have to shape it. I don't have to roll it. I don't have to do. No. Carla? And then it, I, what? You're my goddess. Thank you. And look, you have the milk and everything, so try another. I'm a, now, are you guys ready, George? Are you? Are you? To dip or not to dip? Yeah. Like actually, actually gone. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Three fifths, eight to ten minutes, and then and then there you have it. This is good. Yeah, they're good. They're good. Right. Yep. Mmm. Cheer. Cookie cheers. Cheers. Cookie mm. cheers. Mm. Mm. I mean. Yeah. Thank you, Carla. Mm. So How are they? Any other tips you want to give us, Carla? Any other tips when you... Because people are intimidated by cookies. The, the thing is, I think, it's all about the temperature of your ingredients. Mm. And also, don't over mix it. And chill the dough first. If you don't chill the dough, you're going to get that soft cookie spread it all over your sheet pan. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and so oatmeal cookies sometimes, even like chocolate chip cookies, they spread a little bit, they get a little crispy or burnt around the edge, mm -hmm. and then the inside is kind of good. So chilling the dough, good yeah. tip on that. Soft butter, another walk away tip. Dry ingredients don't include the oatmeal. <laughs> <laughs> Correct. The oatmeal is a mix in. And right. when the cookies look just about done, take them out of the oven because the residual heat of the pan is going to continue to cook them. 
All right. Pro tips. That's an amazing thing. Scan the QR code on the bottom of your screen to get this recipe, and you will want it for the holidays. GoodMorningAmerica.com. And you can catch the lovely Carla Hall on the Holiday Baking Championship Gingerbread Showdown Mondays Woo. on the Food Woo. Network. Woo. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.